Heraclit said, War is father of all and king of all. He renders some gods, others men. He makes some slaves, others free. We see today that this is not true. The present military aggression of Ukraine by the leaders of the Russian Federation makes neither the Russian Federation nor Ukraine free. Contrary, the only reason for this attack is to sustain suppression in the aggressor country and to force the suppression of freedom and democratic development on others. We are scientists and we want to uncover the law governing our world and to most the most important conditions for this undertaking is the freedom of thought, the freedom of speech and the free exchange of our ideas and suggestions. The free exchange between nations over all borders. This is possible only in a world of free nations, of respect of different cultures, the respect of individual opinions. These principles were not realized in Europe when I started my scientific career, but I could participate in the project to realize these principles within the scientific community in Europe. And I saw it realized in the free and fruitful cooperation with the Institute for Condensed Metaphysics of the National Academy of Science of Ukraine. I feel helpless since I cannot stop the present war. I can only call others to do so. If I can only protest against the aggressors and to call more powerful institutions for help.